is CBS 42 News at Noon. New at noon, here's a statistic that might alarm you. The state of Alabama is ranked number six in the nation for vehicle and train fatalities. This statistic is prompting an event that raises awareness for the need for caution near railroad crossings and train tracks. So joining me now to talk about rail safety days is Nancy Hudson of Alabama Operation Lifesaver. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. Of course. So tell me about this event. The event is Rail Safety Days in Calera. Uh, several years ago, the governor and the Department of Transportation declared June to be Rail Safety Month. So we've got a few locations around the state, and uh, we always love to go to Calera. They host our event for the two days uh, because there will be safety information, focusing on rail safety, but everybody that comes also gets a free train ride. A free train ride. Okay, mm -hmm. so that's some incentive. And I see you've got some props with you. Tell me about this slogan right here. Our slogan is see tracks, think train. We want people to get in the habit of that because every, si every time you see tracks, you really should expect there to be a train. And since trains do not run on schedule, we should expect a train every single time we approach a crossing. Okay, I see. And we were just saying Alabama ranks in the top 10 for these uh, unfortunate crashes. Um, tell me more about that. Well, last year we were number eight. Now we're number six. Uh, Alabama is, I think, unique because we have over 6,000 public and private crossings. And in the southeast, we're typically very mobile. So if you need to go somewhere, you're driving and you mix all those crossings with drivers that are many times distracted from the drive, that, that they just miss the crossing or they're in a hurry and they don't think they've got time to wait. But I like to think that everybody's life is worth the wait. Oh, definitely. And I saw y'all's statistics most recently from 2015 on your website. It mentioned there were five fatalities that year for all of Alabama and I believe 90 crashes total. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. With it being summertime, a lot of kids out of school, I know a lot of kids like to walk on the tracks, take photos out there. What's your advice to them? Don't. <laughs> you know, really, uh, railroad property is private property. So to be out there is technically trespassing. Mm. Uh, last year, we crawled up the list to number 14 for fatalities of people walking on the, the crossings and on railroad property. That was the first time in over 20 years that Alabama had ever ranked that high okay. with trespass. So, Thank you so uh, much for that information. We yeah. really appreciate you coming out. And we will be right back just after a short break. That event info on your screen right now.